Hello everyone, I'm Marshall Bierke, a program manager on the Microsoft Dynamics CRM Online team. Now that we've announced this great new version of CRM, I wanted to take a minute to walk through a quick demo of the Microsoft Dynamics CRM Online upgrade scheduling experience. I took screenshots earlier and want to walk through them with you now. Keep in mind this demo is from an internal environment and actual dates will vary from what you see in the screenshots. Without further ado, let's get started. Microsoft will be pre-scheduling each Microsoft Dynamics Serum online organization for an upgrade to occur during the evening hours over the next few months. Once we schedule your organization, your CRM administrators will receive an email with this information, as well as directions on how to change their schedule if they would choose to. This is an example of that email. As we can see, my organization has been scheduled for an upgrade on January 13, 2011. The date doesn't really work for me as my sales team is going to be doing a big push that week to clear up the Christmas inventory. Let's click this link and see what options Microsoft has given me. Okay, so on this page I can see that I've been scheduled for a preferred and an alternate date. In this case, my preferred date doesn't really work for me, and I know I want to change that date. And let's see what I can do. Let's click this Upgrade Scheduling Wizard link. Okay, this looks kind of familiar. It's almost like booking a flight on Bing Travel. Let me click this calendar control and see what dates are available for the upgrade. Okay. Uh, January 17th, that looks good. That's Martin Luther King Day and the, everyone in the office is going to be out. So that's perfect. Let's pick that date. Okay, now that I've picked the primary, i got to get a backup date. Um, that's just in case something goes wrong with the upgrade. Uh, Microsoft wants to make sure that um, I'm upgraded to the new version of CRM Online. So let's see... What, what do we have here? Okay, the, the 26th, we've got a team building event that evening, so I think that'll work great. Um, the whole office will be out, so let's schedule the upgrade during the evening on the 26th. Okay, looks like it got what I wanted. Let's click Next. Okay, so this is the summary page, and it says um, that the users of my organization won't be able to access it during these times, but we've already established that's good because we've got Martin Luther King Day and we've got um, that team building event on that Wednesday, so we're all set there. Let's click Schedule. Okay, looks like we're back where we started from. So looks like January 17th between 6 a.m. and 6 p.m., which is during the day. Perfect. And and then we've got January 26th from 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. the following day. So that's that's exactly what we wanted. Not bad. Well, I hope this demo gave you a good idea about what the upgrade scheduling process looked like. And uh, thank you, and have a great day.